Today I want to introduce you to a really helpful little add-on to your Evernote. And even if you don't use Evernote, you might find this tool pretty useful. This is Skitch. Now, Skitch is an application that lets you record an image. Um, so you could take a screenshot of an image and then write on it, point to things, draw things. It can be really helpful. So the Patreon right now is where you can get Skitch. That's at evernote.com slash Skitch. You can also find it in the App Store. You can put it on your iPad, your iPhone. I know they have Android versions, uh, works Windows, Mac. You know, you can use it all over the place. What One of the great things about Skitch is it will sync to your Evernote account. So all the images that you work on will automatically be backed up. Now let me show you um, Skitch just a, a quick minute so you know what I'm talking about. So this is Skitch. You can see I actually have a lot of different images here. I was took this one earlier today. I was working on some menu planning and I wanted to print out the menu, but um, it, the I didn't have a good print option from the browser I was in, so I actually used Skitch to take an image the, and I defined the image the way I wanted. So. That's just a quick idea of how Skitch is, and this is where you can link it to Evernote. This is actually my Evernote account that I'm linked to here. So this is Skitch. Come back, I'm going to show you more details about how to use it, what you can do with it, um, and just introduce you to it some more because it's a great little tool. Hi, today we are going to talk a little bit about Skitch and the different types of images that you can take with it. So Skitch is an application that lets you take screenshots, take images, write on it, mark up, mark it up, and then you can back it up automatically into your Evernote account. So let's look at what kind of images we can take now. So I have Skitch open right here, and I'm on a Mac, and you can see I have a couple different options. I could do a full screen image and you can see it took the image of my whole computer right there. Or I can do a crosshair. Um, so you can see it's going to take exactly the area I want. So if I want this area, I can go there, which is great because it's really specific. Also, you can do a timed screen snap. So if, like, if you needed to set something up specifically, um, there's a little delay. So you're going to see that's going to wait five seconds. And I'm pretty sure that is configurable in the preferences area of Skitch. There's also the camera option. So I can use the camera on my computer and take a photo of myself. So if you knew you wanted to use that and mark it up or something, you'd have that option. Um, you can open an existing image on your computer. You can start with a blank image, and that's where you might just want to, you know, mark it up yourself and draw or different things. You know, a lot of a lot of options that you can can do with Sketch. Let's see, um, and that's if you want to open an older Sketch document. Most of you aren't going to do that. We won't talk about that. So those are the different types of images you can capture. You can also see them up here in your toolbar, in the capture, in your, the application menu bar, in the capture menu. So those are the different types of image captures you can do with Sketch. Come back and I'll show you a little bit more in the next video about these different areas and, area, arrows and markups that you can do with Sketch.